Hello YouTube. So in this YouTube video, I'm going to show you how to update your Samsung Galaxy S4 or unroot your Samsung Galaxy S4. So to start off with, uh, things you need for this is uh, basically a USB cable to connect your phone and your PC and the Odin uh, software and the, of course the Samsung uh, firmware itself so if you're watching this to actually update uh, your Samsung mobile phone there are actually three methods where you can uh, how you can actually update your mobile phone the first method is using the uh, over the air second method is updating using your Samsung keys on your PC and of course one more is a manual update via Samsung Odin this is uh, the one that I'll be showing you in this video. I have included uh, links below in the description for you. Uh, one of it is uh, instruction instructional uh, website. You how to uh, update your firmware to your latest firmware. And there are also links where you can actually uh, download your firmware. So uh, you can actually just download the firmware, the latest firmware for your region. So what you need in this video uh, is actually to download the uh, Sam latest Samsung uh, firmware. We have uh, attached the link in the description below and just uh, extract the files here. So other than the Samsung uh, firmware, you need the Odin software as well. So the Odin software is also a zip file. So once you download the Odin so f software, please extract the just extract the Odin zip file. So once you have uh, both the files or software that you are uh, to, to uh, download okay. So uh, you need to switch off your phone So just power it off Okay So uh, once your phone is powered down You need to hold on to the down volume key The power key and the home button you need to enter the uh, download mode for the phone okay so uh, once you're done you actually see this so this is a warning message so uh, we wish to continue so we will be entering the download mode so now as you can see your phone is in the download mode so what you do next is actually just uh, switch on click open up the Odin software that you have extracted so what you want to do is uh, to click on the PDA button on this PDA uh, find the You need to find the Samsung firmware that you have downloaded and extracted. So you just open up that file. You just click start. Forget uh, to uncheck the repartition and make sure these two are checked and this are, is unchecked. This is going to take a while. Uh, probably a few minutes. So now as you can see, uh, it's already starting to... Uh, write the firmware and it's already downloading on your Samsung mob our Samsung mobile <coughs> okay, as you can see we are almost done uh, 17 more seconds on the phone and the uh, Odin software Few more seconds, two more seconds. Okay, as you can see, if everything is completed and successful, we indicate successful. There will be a green. It will be in green. It will indicate a pass, and your phone will actually automatically uh, start itself. The phone will actually.
Alright, so now your mobile phone has already starting to reboot and you no longer need the computer. So as you can see, just swipe it off. You can see, go to the uh, settings menu, to the board, go to about devices. And you can see it's already updated. Uh, the baseband version is already changed to XU. BMEA and the build number is XXUBMEA which is uh, the latest version for the uh, Samsung Galaxy device S4 so uh, those for you who wish to unroot your mobile phone uh, if you if you see the phone is not uh, being restored to the factory, uh, factory settings you need to switch that back off again Okay, so once your mobile phone is off, you need to enter the uh, recovery mode. So how you enter recovery mode is actually hold up the uh, volume up button, power button and the home button. Make sure you re don't press the button for too long and release the button as, long as, you, as soon as you see the uh, Samsung Galaxy uh, logo. Alright, so now you can see you're in the uh, recovery. So, uh, if you are rooted, you probably already know what to do. So, uh, what you need to do is to restore back to your settings is actually uh, wipe all your data and uh, go to the uh, factory reset. Then you need to wipe your cache partition as well. So, this will actually uh, reboot your mobile phone to factory settings and it will reset your counter as well your binary counter for those of you who are rooted and wish to uh, unroot your mobile phone so uh, so how you navigate is the volume up and volume down you scroll up and down the, uh, the screen the menus, the options and the power button will be your enter option so once you have already uh, wiped your cache partition and uh, Restore your, uh, delete all your data and restore all your factory settings. You just, you just scroll back and reboot your mobile phone. So once you actually reboot your mobile phone, it will go back to uh, factory settings. So that's all today. Thank you.